we present a system that generates semantic-driven hyperlapse from first-person panoramic videos. For the results on this paper, we specifically focus on 360 videos. The system detects salient regions and allows users to select specific objects of interest, such as landmarks, and then creates a hyperlapse that focuses on those semantically meaningful areas of interest. We use an automatic path planning algorithm that moves a virtual camera with variable speed to focus on those appropriate areas. Our system can produce stable and attractive hyperlapse videos that match user preferences. Our system consists of four steps. First, we stabilize the panoramic video, then we analyze the content. Next, we find an optimal path that focuses on and transitions between objects of interest to create a hyperlapse that captures the interesting content, and then we render the result. We first stabilize to smooth out distracting camera motion using our panoramic video stabilization algorithm. Next, we over-segment the 360 video into temporal superpixels and compute a saliency score based on visual and motion features. We assign a semantic label for each temporal superpixel using FCN segmentation. The semantic labels are used to drive the region of interest and hyperlapse speed in our final results, such that interesting areas are visible in the resulting hyperlapse. Given the semantic and saliency information, we next solve an optimization to find a virtual narrow field of view camera path and crop perspective views from the input video. We next use our saliency-aware hyperlapse algorithm to select frames and speed up the video until a salient area is in view, where the algorithm will then smoothly slow down the speed when getting close to an interesting object. After running the hyperlapse algorithm to select frames, we apply a final video stabilization to render a smooth result. For this final stabilization pass, in contrast with previous methods that use homographies, we propose an adaptive stabilization method that adaptively selects motion models from translation, similarity, and homography. Our method can reduce the shearing and wobbling artifacts caused by inaccurate motion estimation during camera panning or rapid scene changes. Our algorithm can generate different hyperlapses from the same input video given different semantic labels indicating what objects are of interest to the user. By default, we choose the label with a maximum saliency score, but we also allow users to choose their preferred object labels to customize the hyperlapse. We created an interactive app that allows a user to create semantic hyperlapses. Users can load the 360 video and apply stabilization to smooth it. Once the stabilization is done, our algorithm analyzes the video content and provides a set of semantic labels in the video. The user can then choose their preferred labels to customize the hyperlapse. Our algorithm then generates a hyperlapse based on the selected labels. The resulting hyperlapse as well as some additional details are displayed on the right-hand side of the user interface. We compare the results from Pano to Vid, which creates perspective videos from panoramic inputs. This approach doesn't perform any sort of speed up, so we use Microsoft Hyperlapse to speed up their results to create a comparable baseline. As our results follow the forward motion more than the results from Pano to Vid, viewers have more understanding about the scene and activities in the video. Here we show some additional results.